Hello everyone. My name is Ray. We are from the HCI lab, advised by Professor Xiao Junbi from Sonnenberg University. Today, it is my pleasure to introduce our work, Glance Writer, writing text by glancing over letters with gaze. I will start by showing a demo of text entry using Glance Writer via eye gaze. Glance Writer is an eye gaze based gesture typing decoder that allows users to enter text by glancing over letters without dwelling or crossing over keys. Glance Writer probabilistically decodes gaze path, determine the letters to be typed based on gaze dynamics of gaze motion and gaze location, thus eliminating the need for deliberately marking the starting and ending position of a gesture. Glance Writer is available on both Windows and iOS. On Windows, we use the Toby Eye Tracker to get eye gaze data through Toby's string engine. In iOS, we use the front camera of an iPad Pro, also known as the True Depth Camera, and AR Kit for eye tracking. Today, my talk consists of two parts. In the first part, I will introduce gesture typing decoder and the design of Gans Writer. In the second part, I will talk about two user studies we conducted to demonstrate the effectiveness of Gans Writer. iGaze based text input is an important text entry method for hands free input and for people with motor impairments. Existing dual based methods require a dual time to activate key selections and avoid midas touch effects, where users unintentionally select unwanted targets by gazing upon them. However, it is slow and causes eye fatigue. Eye gaze based gesture typing methods usually require explicitly defining the starting and ending positions of a gaze path. For example, eye swap proposed by Andrew Crouchy requires reverse crossing on the first and last letter of a word to signal the starting and ending of a gesture. We present Glance Writer, which allows users to enter text by glancing over keys one by one without any dwelling or crossing over keys. A user enters a word by moving a gaze cursor into the soft keyboard and glancing over keys on the soft keyboard to enter them and moving the cursor away from the keyboard to signal the end of entering a word. Gans Writer probabilistically decodes gaze path, determine the letters to be entered based on gaze dynamics of gaze motion and gaze location. For example, when entering half, the decoder determines the probability of a tap letter being the intended one by distance score and stability score based on the points on the gaze path. The decoder then dynamically updates the key scores as eyes glancing over keys. Glance Writer uses a try based data structure. As a user glances over keys, all the letters in the immediate vicinity will be added to the try and a special score of a word is summation of key scores in its leave to root path. More specifically, the key score of a key i represents the probability of a key being the key a user wants to type. We assume that the distance from a gaze point p to the center of the key i follows a Gaussian distribution. So we take the Euclidean distance d from i to p and calculate the distance score DIP using the Gaussian probability density function. The eye gaze stability score GIP measures to what degree a gaze point P stays there inside near the vicinity of a key I. The key score KIP is the product of distance score and the stability score. We take the key score KI as the maximum of KIP over all gaze points with the boundary of the KI. 
The spatial word score represents how likely a user intends to input a word. It is the summation of key scores in the leave to root path in the try data structure. Lastly, we combine word score with language model to obtain the overall probability of a word being the intended input following the principle proposed by Christensen and Jai. We use a background language model in our program. Gauss writer decode the outputs the top five candidate words according to their total scores descendingly. Here's another example. If a user glances over letters M, O, V, E, the decoder outputs move as the top candidate word, followed by more, mode, node, and so on. In the second part, I will talk about two user studies we conducted to demonstrate the effectiveness of Glance Writer. In the first user study, we compare Glance Writer with iSwipe in a text transcription task. To recap, iSwipe uses reverse crossing to signal the starting and ending letter of a word. Compared to iSwipe, Glance Writer increases input speed from 6 words per minute to 10 words per minute and reduces the error rate from 6% to 2%. In a survey of subjective ratings, Glance Writer is less mentally and physically demanding than iSwipe and is more comfortable and easy to learn. In the second user study, we compare Glance Writer with Toby's Communicate 5 keyboard. Toby is a mature eye tracking company and its Communicate 5 keyboard in Toby Dynavox is widely used by people with motor impairments, such as ALS patients. We treat it as a black box gesture typing keyboard. Compared to Communicate 5 keyboard, Glance Writer increases input speed from 7 words per minute to 9 words per minute and reduces error rate from 16% to 12%. It also receives more favorable ratings in all categories. Here I want to show a real scenario demo as a user uses Glance Writer to enter two phrases in our experiment. To sum up, we propose a new gaze-based decoder Glance writer that probabilistically decodes gaze path, determine the letter to be typed based on gaze dynamics of gaze motion and gaze location. Our user studies show that glance writer improves typing speed and typing accuracy over two baselines, iSwap and Communicate 5 keyboard, advancing gaze-based text entry one step further. Thank you all for listening.